What's up, everybody? Nate Alba here. I'm an assistant football coach at Unity High School and uh, producer of Chief Pigskin Online Clinic alongside Anthony Gonzalez, coach, the head coach at Everett Alvarez High School. And Coach is joining our Chief Pigskin team. Coach, so happy to have you. Thanks for joining me tonight. Oh, man, I'm happy to be here, too. Super excited and super, like, pumped just to, you know, make videos and meet new coaches around uh, California and Arizona on the West Coast. Well, just so that for the guys that are watching that don't know, that we've been – the online clinic – this is year three of the online clinic and mm -hmm. has been – probably the coolest project I've personally been a part of as far as like not coaching project. Um, and it, it, it's been growing steadily. And one priority that we had for this year was, well, one priority that's always been a part of the online clinic was to be nationwide, right? It couldn't just be, you know, I'm from central Illinois it, and it, I knew it. I, we couldn't grow anything, grow anything special if it was just central Illinois football. Right, it was a big priority to be nationwide. So the last two years, you know, spent a, spent some money to get my rear end across the country. And um, but you know, even no matter how much money you spend, you can only travel across the country so much. Um, so we put out a big call to, for guys to join the Chief Pigskin team. Worked out a system that we thought was fair and would work to get guys motivated to to join it and be a part of it. And you were one of our guys to join our team, and you're actually. We're, we're having guys join in an order, like as we grow, and you were our first guy in. Um, what made you want to do what I've been doing, which is traveling around, meeting coaches, and shooting video? Honestly, um, it's kind of been an ongoing thing. Like when you, I guess I would consider myself a young head coach, but when you're a young head coach and you're trying to find resources for yourself, uh, the first thing I did was uh, join up on Twitter, and then you, you just kind of notice how good the uh, the coaching Twitter verse is and how everyone kind of helps each other out and then um, I stumbled across Chief Pigskin and I've been honestly I've been a fan and been a member for like the past year and a half uh, yeah about a year year and a half and when you put that out I was like dude this is a great opportunity to go out meet coaches from all across California see the things that they do because honestly like I know I'm not the best at what I do, and I could always learn from someone who's been there and done that. And, you know, I'm just always looking to learn and trying to make myself better so I can take that to my kids and make them better as well. Well, like, we have five total guys that are going to be joining as shooters, and they'll be at As of right now, two are starting right away. We're all meeting in Atlanta in January, and we're mm -hmm. going to be – we're training everybody on how to shoot. You know, just – we. Quality has always been really important to us. Um, and as far as like content, a lot of coaches have asked me, hey, what do you want me to speak on? And I've always said, listen, mm -hmm. I want you to speak on what you're most passionate about because that always makes the best content. I've always said that we could have 10 videos on the exact same O-line topic. If all 10 guys are passionate about that topic, all 10 are going to be interesting. And that's all there is to it, yeah. right? And so, um, sure, definitely. It that so we've got five guys jumping on board to just go out and travel. And so you're going to be you're we're hope you're going to be shooting eight total videos this see, this year. You're going to visit eight coaches, Correct. and um, mm -hmm. I don't know if you've been kind of thinking through who I'm going to go to. The coolest thing for me, as I said, I may have said it before we turn the cameras on, is w our priority of being nationwide, and we got a guy now in California. And who's going to be helping us get the West Coast. And let's face it, there's a lot more than eight great coaches on the West Coast. So you gotta, you're gotta, you going to have your hands full <laughs> yeah. picking eight guys per year. But at least we're going to get a taste of West Coast football. You know, what is something – what do you think um, the West Coast – what's high school football like out in California? What, what's the world of California high school football? That's a big question. That is a huge question because honestly, like I said, this is only my – I've only been a head coach for two years. I've been coaching for 10, but – I have coached in Southern California, and it's it's pretty big down there. Well, tell um, I was, everybody where you are, by the way. Oh, um, I'm in uh, Salinas, California. It's in Monterey County, so Central California, um, right on the coast. If you drive or if you end up in San Francisco, it's like two hours south. Okay. And honestly, if you look at where your lettuce packages come from, 
it's probably going to say Salinas. Okay. Like that's where we live. We live in the salad bowl. It's a huge ag, uh, ag town here. And, um, but yeah, our variety of football in this area, I mean, you name it, we got it. Like there's a really good team. Like they like to be a flex bone team. Um, I'm a wing T guy for offense myself. A lot of dudes are running spread obviously around here too. Um, it's, it's a really good little football area. Um, our, our section includes the West Catholic hosts like Sarah and Valley Christian. Um, they're just really out of this world. Good. Um, and then obviously down South, you know, there's matter day, St. John Bosco and up North, um, Placer high school is really good. Um, they run the wing tee as well. So like, there's just football everywhere. It doesn't matter where you're looking in California. There's always little pockets of where it's just football town everywhere. Now I see on Twitter in California, they say CIF champs. So there's not like one state championship. Is that correct? Um, or like, no, it's there's like, it's there's a- like, there's seven and then there's two divisions in each one. Okay. So like right now, this weekend, um, the big one, the big, big game is, um, St. John Bosco and De La Salle. They're in the open. So that's like the big top notch level. And then it just goes down in level from there. And I believe there's seven divisions. And so like you go division one and then division one, double A. Division two, division two, double A, and it's all the way down to seven. But so the division a isn't by, so like when you say division one, division two, that's not size school. That's like division of the state, an area of the state. Is that right? Um, no, it? no, it's not. Um, it's um, so there's always a northern school playing a southern California school. It's okay. always um, like that, and then it just depends on like I don't even know how to say it. Um, <laughs> Well, it sounds really like don't. a very easy system then. It's not. I really, honestly, I, oh, there goes my headphones. I don't think it's an easy system. Um, the way that our playoff system worked in our section, it wasn't easy to figure out either. <laughs> and so we had coaches guessing on who's going to be in and who's going to be out. And honestly, this year, like I was unfortunate and my team was out and a lot of people thought we were in. And it's just like, oh, God. And so it's it's a little confusing with how things get set up. Um, it's just all like, got to go do that CIF research. Yeah. Well, what do you think, man, as you think about what this year is going to look like for you, as far as chief pig skin goes, I've told guys that, you know, all of us are, we have full-time jobs. We're football coaches. So it's not by any means anywhere close to a full-time job for us, but yet it is, we're going to be doing something every month, kind of being involved in the game. What do you, what do you think this year is going to be like for you? Um, traveling a little bit and, and meeting some new guys and, and being able to share that content on Chief Pigskin? Honestly, I think it's going to be fun. I think it, I'm super excited to um, just reach out to coaches and meet new, meet new coaches and just see their way of doing things. Um, like you said, I already have like an idea of who I want to contact already. Um, I already talked to a coach down in um, San Diego, and he's super pumped, and he's, he's totally in. Um, and, um, yeah, I'm just super excited to, you know, just meet them, see the facilities. Cause obviously like my, the, the stuff at my school is going to be different from the stuff at the stuff in Southern California, different than Northern California. And when you just get to see various sites and meet new guys and talk about ball, like how can you go wrong? You just, you can't, it's just a good day. Well, we're excited to have you on board, man. You're at, again, you're at, uh, is it's Everett Alvarez high school, right? Do you yeah, guys call correct, yourselves correct. one or the other for sure? Or um, most people just say Alvarez to make it Alvarez. to make it okay. quick. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so, so, so you're at Alvarez in Salinas, California, mm-hmm. and um, again, we're super excited to have you. So as we grow, a lot of our shooters, we've we've tried to spread ourselves out around the country, and you're our first West Coast guy. Uh, so I'm super excited. You know, we got a lot of people that are already on board with Chief Pigskin and the online clinic. Um, yeah. And I've just been – I'm so excited because finally, for a long time, I've tried to pull Chief Pigskin away from me, right? And people – and I and I get mm-hmm. it. People associate Chief Pigskin with me because, right, I was the only coach I could afford for the longest time. It's like <laughs> I would have had somebody else doing the videos and being the talk show host if I could have afforded someone else. 
but I was the only coach I could afford. So there I was in front of the camera. So I'm so excited to get new faces in front of the camera, a young um, up and coming head coach like yourself. And you'll be on the West Coast, man. How can people look you up on Twitter? Um, Twitter, it's AV Gonzalez 831. That's the area code in, in town. And most people from Salinas, when they see that 831, they're like, oh, I know where you're from. And it's like, that's right. <laughs> okay. That's where I'm from. So I'm All right, great. right there look, on Twitter. Everybody look Coach up on Twitter. And uh, we're looking forward to getting our, getting our California pipeline of content coming, Coach. Um, Coach was just married. So congratulations. He's taking off for his honeymoon. <laughs> you're heading to Europe, thank right? You, thank you. That's correct. And going to be there until the 2nd of January, just in time to uh, come back and hang out with you guys in Atlanta. That's right. Us coaches will be in Atlanta talking ball, learning how to shoot, and making sure everybody knows how to hold a camera. You know, it's surprising how many football coaches struggle a little bit with things like tripods. Um, <laughs> so we'll make sure everybody's ready to go. All right, Coach, thanks again. And mm -hmm. uh, for all you guys, thanks for checking out the online clinic and for all your support, if you've already supported. If you have any questions about the online clinic, hit me up on Twitter, hit Coach up. Um, look us up anytime. We're happy to talk ball. We'll see you guys soon. See you later.